Hey guys, welcome back. Well, 32 Ford that we've been working on for the last while, uh, she's finally done, boys and girls. Um, overall, she turned out really good. I'm happy with it. Uh, it's an AMT kit again. Um, now what can I say about AMT? Um, I haven't done an AMT kit for a while. I'm kind of a, turned into a rebel guy. I used to be an AMT guy, but um, fit and finish on AMT compared to Revel is... Um, Certainly not up to what Revel is, but anyway. Overall, it was a half-decent kit to build. Uh, again, 3D printed some wheels and tires for it. Got the stance down low like I like it. Uh, Two-tone metallic blue on the bottom, uh, silverish gray on the top. And overall, it wasn't, uh, it wasn't a bad kit to build. Would I build one again? I eh, don't know, because I think the V8 in this kit is a was an afterthought so you got to cut the firewall in half and it just it that part of sticking a v8 in this kit just seemed like an afterthought when they made this kit but anyway we'll move on uh, i'll give you a front profile oh like so i like the stance on this really do then again didn't run the um, side panels on the front hood because it gets really tight on where the motor is and I wasn't going to do that. I'm going to run into a problem where it wasn't going to fit when I finished so I just left it off. It's just open on both sides. But yeah, overall it turned out pretty good. Them the little finishing touches from last video, the little button uh, panel, the little buttons on the uh, upper door panel, and uh, door handles, got headlights glued in place, uh, swing around the back. Uh, it turns out he does have this type of uh, tail lights on the back of it, and I just threw on one of my little Canadian, uh, Canadian flags on the back. Yeah, I don't like it. Turned out good. Take the hood off. Hang on. What up? Yeah, we went with one of my 3D printed air cleaners on it because it's close to what uh, he has on his uh, one to one car. But yeah, got a rad hose on there. Some little hose clamps made for it. Turned out good. A little detailing on the firewall, just use some Molotov just to highlight some of the voltage regulator and some of the other things going on in the firewall. Um, this kit comes with, when you have the windshield on there, it's got these little side window vents that stick out. I don't think his car has that on his, so I cut those off. It's just got the, just the windshield um, by itself. Yeah, they're not good. I don't like it. So next we got to do is mount it in a case for my son, and uh, he can uh, give it to uh, give it to Jenna's father. Yeah, overall turned up pretty good. I like it. Get you up. Hang on. Guess what? We're going up. Whoa! Look out! Coming down. There we go. Should set this up on a little turntable for you guys rather than look at my ugly hands in this video. But it is what it is. I like it. <clears throat> Excuse me. All right, guys and gals, that's it for the 32. Uh, on to the next project. I mentioned in the last video that I had a car that I want to do with some wheels I want to use. 
And of course, as soon as I flashed up the camera, I went, oh yeah, you said you might uh, unveil that in this video. Guess what? I'm not prepared, so you'll have to wait till the next video, boys and girls. Anyway, as usual, thanks for stopping by. We'll talk to you guys soon. See you later.